Hello, today I'm going to teach you how to prepare cop noodles. The cop noodles that I have here are from Nissen and they are the chicken flavor variety. Now, for many people, making cup noodles can be a difficult task. It can be a little bit confusing. So hopefully I'm gonna make that a little bit easier here today. The first thing we wanna do is remove the cardboard cutout from our cup noodles. You noodles might not have this. Also, don't fail like I did. If they don't have this, don't worry about it. Now, they'll probably have a plastic wrapping on them. So we want to delicately remove the plastic wrapping. Be careful not to puncture the cup as water can spill out and that water can be hot. Also try not to puncture the lid on top as it will reduce the effectiveness of the cup. Now, let's take note of some things on the top of the cup on the lid. First note where it says lift here. This is a tab that the manufacturer provides. You're gonna use that tab to lift the lid up. Don't lift it up all the way, just a little bit will do. Also take note that you do not want to microwave the cup. The manufacturer advises against this. Instead, you're going to want to boil water in a separate container. Also note the warning where it says the product will be hot. This can be hazardous, so proceed with caution. Now, the manufacturer outlines a game plan for us. The first step, we're going to want to boil water in a separate container. After we have done so, we're going to want to pull the lid back just a little bit. You don't want to pull it up all the way. It'll make things a little bit easier for you. And you want to add the boiling water to the fill line. For step two, you want to close the lid and then you want to let the container stand for about three minutes. You can hold a little bit longer if you want to. It'll make the noodles a little bit softer and some people prefer it that way. There's nothing wrong with that. And step three, after we've done step one and two, we can proceed to enjoy our noodles. So let's carry out those instructions. Uh, I'm going to begin by pulling the lid back. And I pulled it back a little bit too much. You don't want to pull it back all the way, and you'll see why. Now we can see the contents of the um, cup of noodles. We can see the noodles. There's going to be seasoning in there, some vegetables. And right now, I'm pointing to the fill line. If you're having trouble seeing it, you can feel it with your fingers. It's going to be a groove on the inside of the cup. So now we want to actually prepare the boiling water. So I prefer to use a tea kettle to prepare the boiling water. I find it a lot easier than using a pot because tea kettles have a nice spout and it helps to really control the water as you're pouring it. With a pot, you might spill it and if it spills on you, it's gonna hurt because it's boiling water. And I'm using an electronic uh, tea kettle here. So all I did was I just flicked that switch and now as you can see, the water is starting to boil. You're seeing condensation on the inside of the container. And very soon, we're gonna have boiling water, and we're gonna use that boiling water to finish preparing our noodles. Very exciting. Now it's done. So very gently, and be careful, pour the water into the cup. And you're gonna to wanna to fill it to the line as I've showed you earlier. And it doesn't have to be exactly at the line. It's okay if it's a little bit off, it'll be just fine. Just try to get as close as you reasonably can. Now, after we've done this, we want to close our lid. So you can see why uh, pulling it back was detrimental because it's having a hard time staying down. So really you want to pull it back about halfway, it'll make it a lot easier. But it's okay, if this happens to you, you can fix it by just putting a weight on it. I like to use the eating utensil that I will be eating it with. I like to use a fork because I like to eat the noodles and then I like to drink the broth afterwards. You can use whatever you want, you can use a spoon, chopsticks, I've heard of some people using a knife. That's completely up to you. After the time has elapsed, we can remove our weight and open up our lid. And you can see the noodles have increased in size. The water level has gone down just a little bit. And I like to stir it up a little bit before I eat. It just makes it a little bit more consistent and it makes the experience a little bit more enjoyable. And that's it. Congratulations. You've just made a cup of noodles. 
please leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. It would mean a lot to me. Thank you.